Hello and welcome back to another episode of the Will It Fish Challenge. This week we are throwing bottle caps. That's right. Do fish like beer? That's what I want to know. If I don't catch a fish today, I got to donate $25. I'm going to go ahead and call it the American River Association. That's good for conservationists, outdoorsmen, so on and so forth. I'm going to start with this Boulevard one here. Let's do this thing. So these things are actually pretty simple to make. I basically took some heavy gauge wire, got some swivels, split rings, bottle cap, and some small little like nuts, like nuts and bolts, and uh, put it together. Now all that stuff is linked in the description below if you want to try to make your own. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and rig this up. All right, so we got this one rigged up. I actually have a little feathered treble on this one, but we're gonna see if we can put it to good use. My biggest question, my biggest concern is how fast will these things sink? I think this one's got a little bit more weight to it, so it should sink at a decent rate, probably just enough. The water's a little clearer here than I would like because when you have clear water, I'm not so sure they'll wanna eat this, but hey, I believe there's fish here. I'm confident that we can put this thing to good use. Let's, uh, let's go catch one. I feel like there's gotta be some fish in here. Cast number one. The fall rate, I'm pretty happy with. I'm gonna do a twitching retrieve just because I don't want him to see it very well. I want him to just bite it out of reaction. crappie aren't really reacting to the old bottle cap. There's all sorts of crappie down there. They're not gonna eat this though. I need some minners. I think it looks pretty tasty though. I mean, come on. It probably has some beer residue on it. Get a little buzz on. On a dreary day like this, what kind of fish wouldn't wanna get their buzz on? I don't know if I'm gonna catch one today or not. I don't think I'm gonna catch one here, so might as well keep moving and grooving. There's just gotta be some bass hiding in this stuff. So I'm just gonna twitch this around in some of the holes and just hope that there's like a little 14 inch bass that'll react to it. There's enough water to where they could be cruising around in here. There's like a billion geese here and they just don't shut up. They're the loudest damn birds on the face of this earth. No luck. We are now on another dock and the water's pretty shallow, but I'm just gonna wing this thing out there and see what happens. The camera's in kind of a sketchy location, so I'm gonna try to be very careful about it. All right, I need to head to a different part of this lake. I have no idea where the fish are. All right, we're going to the next spot. All right. All right guys, so thus far, no luck. Haven't caught a fish, haven't got a bite. It's been rough. It's windy, it's cold. I don't understand it. I can't catch a break, but I, let's hope that I can catch a fish. Let's do this thing. I still am confident that we're gonna figure this out. Time will tell, time will tell. It's time to focus according to this vitamin water. Let's see if the sweet succulent nectar tastes good. By golly, I'm so focused, it's unreal. Let's catch a fish. Got him. Oh, it's a good bass. It's a good bass. Holy cow. Oh, no way. No way. Oh, gosh. Don't come on. Oh my gosh, holy cow. Look at that folks, on the bottle cap. You think he wanted that? Let's go. Look at that fish. She was bleeding a bit so I just wanted to get her back. But hey man, boom. I am walking through town talking to a camera. I just fixed my camera. I thought it was broken, but it turns out I just had it on some weird setting. I was scared because I dropped it on the cement earlier, which was terrible. Regardless, the Boulevard wheat pulls through. That's right, folks. Bass like Boulevard wheat. Let it be known. Share this, Boulevard wheat. Share this on your Facebook page. That would really make me happy. Oh, yeah. I think a beer is in order for that fish. 
Better hold on to that because I might just catch a Mondo Bass on it. If you want to make your own one of these, look in the description below. I've got the links to all these different materials. And then um, obviously the bottle cap, you're just gonna have to drink a beer or a soda if you're underage. And now that I've cut a fish in two uh, Will It Fish Challenge episodes straight, that means that the pot went to $30. So basically if I don't catch a fish in my next episode, I will have to donate $30 to a cause that benefits outdoorsmen, conservationists, etc. Thank you so much for watching guys. Go try this for yourself. Go try it right now. Cheers.